So we're, we're here today with the Lex, this is the Lexi van? Lexi van? Yeah, butane soldering kit, uh, multi-purpose tool kit. So this is gonna, this is gonna be a, a lifesaver uh, for the shop. You need to have one of these. We, uh, we would use some of, this is a traditional soldering gun. You can kind of see the old soldering gun. This is a cheaper one. I think we got this from Harbor Freight or something. Uh, but we're gonna try this one out and see what it does. The tool trucks sell something like this, but for a lot more expensive. Yeah, so I got this on Amazon. We bought, so I actually had one from, uh, I think it was Matco. I bought it several years back and I think I paid, dude, I paid a lot for it. I paid a lot for it. And uh, I found this one on Amazon. I was like, you know, I'm gonna buy one from Amazon. I'm gonna give it a shot and see how it works. So let's, let's give it, see what it looks like. Um, I'm gonna go like this. <laughs> but let's open it up. It has a nice box to it. Let's see. It has a serial number, it's pretty cool. So, so just, I can add to this a serial number. Uh, one thing, if you, have a, if you have a repair shop or you're a technician, uh, take a picture of your serial numbers for your tools. And so the reason why I'm saying this is because one time we had some stuff stolen from the shop and luckily I had the serial numbers on it. And I was able to make the police report and give them the serial numbers because when someone pawns that, that stuff, they can do a serial number track and they can get your shit back. So just a little tip there. I think they also do online warranty for these. Dang, so this is pretty nice. Look at this. Nice little, little finish there. So where's the, oh, so I guess the tank's in here. No, it's built in. Oh, it's built in, nice. So let's fill this. So we got, we got our, our refill. You can buy this from AutoZone or Riley's. Mm -hmm. We got this from a rise. We just called them uh, first call. They brought it really quick. Is it? Let me see. This is a lock. How does it? This is. This is a child lock. How does it? Oh, so you flip. Oh, you flip like this. Oh, so you go like this. Oh look, dang, look at that. So you, so you, your thumb there, lock it in place. Boom, nice, look at that little flame. Hey, check this out. Look what I got, look what I got. Let's go scare that bitch. Come on, come on, Mary. come on, come this way. Film him, film him. Get it, go get it. So don't try that at home, kids. Okay, so still on, nice flame. Look at that, dude, look. <laughs> What's she saying? Okay, okay, look, so check it out. So we have a bunch of different attachments here. We have, uh, it's like a little chisel. It's like a little- uh, Oh, that's, another, a, that's a heat cutter. Oh, okay, nice heat cutter. You can even do like the foam with it. Okay, so then we have. Uh, I want to say this might be for the soldering. Mm -hmm. Let's try this one for the soldering. Oh yeah, this is a solder one. So this comes off. Dude, this is sick, dude. This is gonna be sick. Oh, there's the sponge. So this goes. Let me see. How's this go? Oh, this screws on. Oh look, this screw on there. Oh, check this out. This. Hold on. Oh, look. So does this go in there? 
Okay, 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 here it goes. Look, so this part, this is like an adapter. So the adapter goes here, this goes here. Look. Look at that, boom. And then this goes here. Hey, that shit was loud, right? Okay, look, boom, that goes there. And then you, you can tighten it with that. A little tool here. Nice, okay, let's try it, now let's try it again. Oh, it's on, I can feel it, it's getting hot. So the only thing that this one doesn't have, it doesn't have like a little stand on it. So, I don't know what this is. This is a cover. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah, so I mean, I guess that's the only bad thing about this one. It doesn't have a stand on it. So you have to just lay it down. Let's try the soldering. Man, this thing is getting hot, dude. Okay, so we have, we have a wire here that we're going to try out. So this, I'm going to cut this and see what it does. Let's see. Cut that one. I'm going to splice these two together to see how they splice this up. Do we have any heat shrinkers? No. Oh, we do? Let me see. Okay, let me open this box. Oh, nice. Look at that. We have the heat shrinkers here. This one and this one. So this is going to be fucking sick, dude. We have this too. Got this from Harbor Freight. This is this, uh, it's also heat shrinking tube as well. Like this. If you haven't used this before, this is going to be very helpful for your shop. And it's going to eliminate this, uh, this, this uh, electrical tape. So this is gonna, this is really gonna step up your game. Like if you're doing, if you're doing any any uh, electrical repair in your shop. So look, nowadays you can buy, you can buy replacement pigtails. So you can buy the pigtails, and you can you can splice them yourself. And so let's just say we're gonna splice. Let's just do this. Look, I'm gonna cut this off right. I'm gonna pretend that that. Um, this, this is a, 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 an aftermarket pigtail, right? And we're gonna splice it with this. So if you have, uh, for example, we've done this with Ford. You can also buy, um, buy some used pigtails. You can also buy a used pigtail and you can splice them yourself. And so this is gonna make, this is gonna actually make your, your repair like game nice. And you can actually charge the insurance company for this too. So, so all these all these little little things that I'm telling you are ways to, to add you know money money to the to the job. So this is all bottom line revenue. So this is what I mean by that. These are these are um, these are uh, item lines. So like for example, if the if the harness is damaged and you can repair it, you can charge them a couple of hours repair time. All right. So so think about that. So I'm gonna do this here. I mean, you don't even have to, you don't even have to really do that, right? I'm going to try this. I'm not really, I'm not an expert solder guy. So, so, so you, so this is not, you don't have to be an expert to do this shit. I know, I know that this is, you can buy different, different uh, thicknesses of the solder. And I know that the, the lighter one is going to work better. So let's try this out. I'm not like a professional solder guy, so I'm, you're kind of learning with me here. So I'm going to dab it there. Look. look at that. It already soldered right there. And so look. So I'm just going to add some more solder there. Boom. On our last video, someone mentioned about the fumes. Yeah, you kind of want to watch out for the fumes if you're going to be doing like a lot of soldering. That, that's a nice, that's a, oh look, so it has, you can do this, look. So I didn't, you can actually use that as a stand. Okay, perfect. So now that we have this on there, that's on there, dude, look. So I'm gonna come back with this, this, heat, tr this heat shrink and I'm gonna do this, look. So I'm, there, it has the, t the attachment for that, this one. Let's try this one out. So this was, it doesn't go there. So I'm gonna go, let me see. I'm gonna take the attachment off. Remember it's hot, so you be careful. 
I'm just gonna do it like this. I, oh, I can feel the heat right there too. You probably should have took take it off, but I'm gonna just do that. I'm gonna see if this will go on here. Oh, look, it's on there, boom. So this is gonna be on there, check this out, look. So I'm gonna come like this, look at this. Look at that. Come over here. Dude, this is gonna be nice. Look at that, look at that. So I'm heat streaking it. I'm gonna do the backside. Look at that. This heat shrink does look a little, uh, it, it is a little big for this wire. Cause look how it fits on that one real good. It fits on the bottom one. So this, this, this heat shrink is probably made for this wire. So you just gotta keep that in mind that you just gotta keep moving it around. But, but you kind of get the idea of this, what we're doing here. These are real good to be working on in uh, tight areas. Yeah. You don't have to worry about having the wires behind you. So the heat shrink is on that one. It looks, it looks pretty good, dude. It still has a gap right there. Um, I kind of don't like the way that looks, but look, look at the bottom. See it? Remember I said this, this size is probably made for this wire size. So, so we probably need to go with the, um, probably this one is going to probably be, do we have any other sizes for that heat shrink? In here. Oh, look, perfect. So check this out. So you can probably also get one of these. I'll put one of the links to, to this in, in the, in the description, but this has like an assortment of, of different sizes so look so they actually have a smaller one so this is going to be okay the yellow the yellow and the green are going to be the smaller so so we're out of the smallest ones so apparently there's a smaller one than this oh look it's actually in there look look right see it so this is going to be the smaller one so this this will probably fit on this wire good Let's try this. Let's just kind of do a heat shrink on it and see if this one works. Let's just put that in there. Let's, let's, uh, no, I don't want to solder. Let's just do this. I just want to see if this wire is going to, uh, if it, if it's going to tighten up on that better. Let's see. The, the yellow one almost seems like it's it's a little lighter yeah look at the look at how the yellow one it actually it's tighter on on the smaller wire so they do make the smaller size I'll put a link I'll put a link of for this assortment this is gonna be very helpful like I said you can we can but we can connect this butt connector right and we could charge you know an hour for that a 1.5 you can charge and that's electrical time so that's not regular uh, pain and body time that's that's electrical time so you can charge 75 bucks 80 bucks an hour so that that alone is going to add to your bottom line so think about it like this so let's just say you do um, out of the whole year you do 100 of the butt repairs right uh, butt connector repairs times 80 you do the math on that that's going to be your bottom line income so doing those small things are going to help drain and rate more income to your shop okay so like I said this this set is I mean dude get the set Get the set, um, it's, I'm, I'm gonna put the link below for this and this. Get them, let me know what you think in the comments, let me know if you bought it, and let me know if you're able to make money with it. I'll also put one of these, a link of this, in, in the bio. And, um, cause you're gonna need the butane, it doesn't come filled. You're gonna need to get one of these. This gonna, it's gonna last. And then uh, we'll also put a link for, the, for these little snippers on there, these snap-on snippers on, the, on, the, on there as well, okay? All right guys. Uh, we have some more videos coming up, and uh, if you found value in, in, the, in, the, in the content, uh, please like and subscribe to the channel.